it's hard because when you go into the magazines and then you see exactly what people perceive as beauty, and if you look nothing like that, it's like, wow, it's like a slap in the face. Other people's opinion about me has always changed my perception of myself. Living under the people's microscope really affected my self-esteem. I was never skinny enough or good enough. One day, I saw myself through the eyes of an abuser, and I was finally forced to find beauty for myself. One that will end up saving not only my life, but my soul. I was so desperate to have a purpose, a meaning for still being alive. I wanted to honor the fact that I survived. To find something beautiful is to respond to it with pleasure. The only thing common to the experience of all the beautiful things is pleasure. Part of you wanted to experience beauty. If you have to describe beauty, how would you describe? It's all God's creation. Sight is not required to experience beauty. Beauty is not absolute, it's a cultural thing, but it's a variable. This is white, and we can pretty much all agree on that. But if it's something invisible, that's why you're making a whole movie about beauty. <laughs> beauty is a birthright. Just like happiness. You're born with it. You're born with happiness. You're born with beauty. I really find beauty within the imperfections. And this is the story of my quest for beauty.